Okay. Um, so hi everyone. Uh, welcome to DIY uh, Lex 2019. We're from group 10. Uh, my name is Kaushalya Sanmugam. Uh, my matrix number is 203880. I'm from uh, Faculty Medicine and Health Science. I'm taking year two uh, Bachelor of Science, Occupational and Environmental Health. Next person. Hello, everyone. My name is Nur Najah Binti Abdullah. My matrix number is 201120. I'm currently taking the Bachelor of Science Stati Statistics. I'm from Faculty of Science. Next, Eve. Hi, everyone. My name is Eve Leon Yong. Matrix number 203992. So currently, I'm a student from Bachelor of Science Mathematics with Education from uh, Faculty of Science, uh, now in second year. So next, Xia. Uh, hello, everyone. My name is Xia, Xia Jinchao, and uh, my metric number is 208966. Uh, uh, I'm, from, I'm, from I'm from the School of uh, uh, Economic. The next one. Uh, hello everyone, my name is Dai Hui Ying. My matrix number is 202194. I am year two student. I'm currently taking the course Bachelor of Business Administration and from School of Business and Economics. Next, Lee. Hi everyone, my name is Lee Sok Fong. My matrix number is 202221. I'm currently taking Bachelor of Business Administration. Ilham. Hi everyone, my name is Ilham Putra Mintina Bahri. My metric number is 200648. Uh, I'm studying a Bachelor of Accounting and in School of Business and Economics. Uh, next, Aina. Okay, hi. <clears throat> hi, my name is Aina Anissa. I'm Tamat Sidin. My metric number is 200678. I'm a second year student from Faculty of Science taking Bachelor of Science Mathematics. Okay, next. Hello everyone, my name is Wu Yuchun. My magic number is 201637. Uh, I'm from School of Business and Management. My bachelor is Business and Management. Next, Yu Hong. My name is Juan Song. My true number is 204813. I'm from Faculty of Computer Science and Information Technology. Okay, hey, um, thank you everyone. So we're from group four and uh, me and my partner, Noor Najiha, will present our DIY product. Okay, can everyone see the slide? Yes. Yes, can. Yes. Okay, so um, let me introduce. Um, our group, we decided to go for DIY face mask. So um, why we chose DIY face mask is because um, we all know that, you know, uh, face mask is commonly known as an, a luxurious uh, product. And so we decided to go a uh, more affordable one for university students like us. So why we chose DIY face mask is because one is it's affordable and also it's easily accessible. You can get a lot of uh, organic stuffs from at our kitchen itself. And also uh, it is time saving, you know, instead of uh, waiting in line and buying face mask or waiting for the order to receive at your house, you can make it at on the spot and also it is known for its you know purely organic ingredients as well because most of the face mask or any skincare ingredients it is uh quite hot it quite contains like harmful chemicals that may cause sensitivity in our skin 
So upon all our face mask recipes, the one uh, Najiha and I chose were the recipe is turmeric, milk, honey, and flour. So let's see a video. And so um, next, I'll give to Najiha to present her slide. Okay, now I will talk about uh, the benefits of this face mask. First, uh, from the ingredient, uh, turmeric, it contains antioxidants and anti-inflammatory components. So it is good for our face. And second, the milk acts as an anti-aging cleanser. And it also removes dead skin cells and stimulates cell growth to our skin. And the third one is honey. It contains antibacterial and antiseptic properties and also preventing and treating acne on our face. And also it uh, acts as hydrating agent. And the last one is the rice flour. It acts as exfoliating agent and also some beauty influencers claim that the rice flour helps in improving acne and brighten our skin. So what do you guys think about our DIY project? Uh, for me, I think your guys' project is very creative and also uh, it's organic, right? Uh, because uh, since there are no ingredients such as uh, alcohol uh, you know some must contain the alcohol that will cause the sensitivity because my skin is uh, sensitive skin so I think I can it can help to improve my skin because for now I already uh, order some mask but it cost a very good a uh, very expensive three set on uh, it cost 79 ringgit Okay, so it's very expensive. Uh, after see you guys, I think I can make try it. Yeah. So how about others? Yeah, after watching the video presented by Kao Shai and Najiha, it sounds very interesting to me. As like what we say now, the face mask sell in the store is very expensive. The most uh, affordable one, maybe we need to pay for two to three ringgit for one mask only. So, and also is all materials organic. So it's free from chemicals, it's safe to use. I think that, how about others? Uh, I, 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 uh, uh, I think this is, uh, I think this idea uh, is very interesting. Uh, this product is very uh, is very convenient for uh, for our for our life. Uh, I think it's a waste of time of time to buy a new uh, to buy a, uh, to buy a new mask. Um, uh, uh, every time uh, every time uh, we, we run out of the mask. Uh, now we can make. Uh, uh, now we can. Now we can make uh, uh, the face mask. Uh, uh, the face mask uh, in our home. Uh, so I think this is very convenient. Uh, and uh, 
and it and it uh, uh, cheaper than before. I think it's very good. Um, yes, I think this one uh, actually is very good. Uh, good. Uh, because I think uh, uh, the mask in the uh, mail is very simple. Uh, if we DIY the mask like this, we can uh, drive some uh, of uh, our uh, favorite uh, picture in, uh, inside. Um, uh, I think that this one is very uh, interesting team for uh, ourselves, uh, even for uh, different people, yes. So yeah, it would be, I agree with uh, all of you. And also the materials in creating this face mask actually um, is very easy to obtain and it's, it's the price of the materials is really comfortable uh, being compared with uh, the mask that we bought in the shop. So um, beside that, uh, from what uh, Tai said just now that the this face mask is actually um, organic and it's really um, suitable for the people who is sensitive or even allergic. So this is my opinion. So how about Aina? So la, for, the past, for the past few days, I just bought a face mask and it's quite expensive. It's almost, uh, it costs almost 20 ringgit and it's quite expensive to buy at the store. And, more, uh, and last month, I bought mask and I, and I as a Muslim, uh, as a Muslim can use the mask because it's counting sick, sick, which is not halal that is not legal for Muslim. And for me, after see after seeing this Kausha and Najiha DIY project, I think it's a good idea to use. Instead of buying that, we don't know the, the ingredients in the face mask. So that's my opinion. Yeah, I agree with Aina. Since we made uh, on our own uh, this face mask, we know the materials that we use, uh, that is organic, right? Yeah. Um, and I think uh, we also can use uh, aloe vera as our materials for the DIY face mask because uh, aloe vera also has uh, uh, many advantages like um, it acts as a cooling cooling agent, uh, like something uh, we can to reduce our sunburn and aloe vera also helps to moisturize our uh, skin and yeah and I think uh, we can use main, uh, other materials like tomato also uh, as a uh, face mask okay what about you want to add something? Okay, uh, for my opinion, I think this handmade work is very creative. It has brought me a lot of inspiration and let me learn a lot in it. For example, uh, as you said, this is a save time and save money. Uh, when us go to the shop shopping or some uh, the Westerns, right? Uh, maybe we want to buy a mask. We need cost uh, twenty ringgit or thirty ringgit for five pieces or six pieces. It's uh, quite expensive. Besides, uh, the all materials in this mask we have no this that. I mean, uh, no additives or substance to harmful your skin or your health. Is very uh, health, healthy. Yeah, like actually, um, why we chose this DIY face mask is that you know we as a university student, we tend to be more uh, focused on our skin itself. You know, we want some clear skin, healthy skin, beautiful skin. You know, we tend to do anything for it, and so that's why we chose this DIY face mask. You know, to give more insights and like. Ilham said before, like um, we can add or uh, other organic stuffs like aloe vera 
or honey or milk or anything other than that. And it also gives like some uh, different benefits from the other organic materials. What about the others? Yeah, it's really oh. sound very interesting and a good product for us to take care of our skin. But actually, I'm very curious about what is the smell of the face mask. I think um like for turmeric it um it doesn't totally smell like curry flavor because you will add other ingredients right and so the smell will counterbalance all of it 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 it, it smells like somehow organic yeah <laughs> it has no fragrance is what i can say like other face masks it gives you the fruity or lavender smells but this one is more to yeah Uh, does you face any difficulties while you're doing this face mask? Yeah, maybe I have a difficulty because I lack of uh, milk at my home, so I need to buy some of them. So I drink, I drink a little <laughs> to use the balance to make the mask. <laughs> Not all of the meal I use just a little yeah but you can use others if you have like yogurt if you have at home you can use that also. Uh, I also have uh, questions uh, how much time that you take uh, to apply this must after you apply this uh, how much time you wait even uh, you need to wait I think you can put on your face about 10 to 15 minutes, not so long, so that your face not be dehydrated. It's not um, dry on your skin. So just apply it for 10 minutes and then wash it and put some moisturizer. But um, also one thing to consider that um, this is not recommended to use it on everyday basis. It's like two weeks once. So yeah, in, if not, you know, the product of turmeric and then your face will be all yellowish if you use it every day onwards. Yeah, I get your point, Kausha and Najiha. It's a very, very good DIY project that we can make at home. And actually, like how you guys say that we can save up the cost, right? So the cost we save, we can use for other enhancements in our daily life. So actually, it's a very, very good idea. Sounds for me. How about others? Yeah, I agree with what Lee said just now. So I think... I will suggest or recommend this the uh, DIY face mask to others. How about others? Do you recommend uh, this face mask to uh, your friends, your families, or other people? Of course, when especially when you are living with your friends, you can do like a mini spa with your friends. Do it together. Um, yes, I think it's quite uh, enjoying with your friends. Enjoy. Yeah, mini spa sounds like interesting. <laughs> yeah, we will enjoy if we do really uh do it uh with our friends, right? We do it together, and and uh, I I actually um agree with uh Yip. Uh, I I want to recommend it uh to my. Uh, family members and friends also because um, it cost effective and and it is a uh, natural uh, yeah that's all <laughs> so it sounds like this DIY project is more favorable for girls compared to the boys seems the boys very quiet right now so if follow the ingredient will you do the face marks for yourself or you can uh, yes 
uh, uh, I think I will use it. Uh, and uh, can I ask one question to you? Uh, uh, what's uh, difficult uh, uh, when you make this mask? Um, I think um, it depends on the person needs because, you know, if um, like Najiha said before, if you use a lot of milk and then if you want to make a face mask with milk, then you may run out of milk for that. So uh, I think uh, a good advantages for using DIY face mask is that there are other alternatives. You know, you don't have to necessarily use milk. You can use yogurt instead or other products. Uh, yes, so uh, but what is the most important is the all the material is organic. So it is suitable for every skin type, even though you are dry skin or you are the normal skin and for me sensitive skin, I think it will, uh, you will suitable. So that is the most important. Yeah, I quite agree. Like sometimes like now we are in college, right? Sometimes we do not have the fridge to freeze our mask. Nowadays, many masks we need to put in the refrigerator, right? So if we can prepare the ingredients by ourselves, so it's more convenience. Like the materials show by Kaushra and Najiha is very easy to get. So what's your opinions, yeah? Uh, uh, I think um, uh, we don't know how to do a lot uh, and uh, uh, do some each time. Uh, uh, and uh, uh, do some each time. Uh, we need it. Uh, this can avoid waste. And uh, I think, uh, uh, I think safety first. Uh, because our face is very important. Yes, this is my opinion. Yeah, I agree. Since I think uh, we are running out of time, can uh, Najiha do the conclusion? Okay, to conclude our uh, uh, meeting for today, I think uh, our, my DIY project with my partner is very good to try because it is very natural. It's good for your skin, for our skin, and also it is easy to assess. You can just uh, take some ingredients from your kitchen and also yeah, you can easily make it at home. That's all from me and my partner. Yes, remember to share the videos of making letter in the group. Huh? Okay. Thank you for both of you. I think we can end this discussion right now and look for you guys in the next discussions. Okay. Thank, Thank you, guys. Everyone. Thank, Thank you, you, everyone. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye